This is a video on twisting in two primary ways that twisting is taught. One of them is that we set ourselves up, we let the pelvis move as we move into the twist. Another is, is recognizing that the twist is arising from the engine, which is the obliques, ribs moving relative to the pelvis in the sitting twist, and that the obliques are pulling us around. Both of those methods of teaching are very effective because in the former, when the pelvis is moving with, a lot of times that's taught to be safe. And the reason being is because a lot of times people over leverage with their arms and reef themselves around making a twist more of an arm pull. And then that can actually put way too much force down through the bottom part. And then people can hurt their lumbar spine and SI and knees and a variety of other things that can arise out of poor mechanics, right? This way of thinking about the obliques being the engine of the twist now focuses the movement where a rotation of the torso arises from, which is the obliques. Now, you won't go as far. It might not feel as delicious, but anatomically, we're now moving ribs to pelvis, really focusing on here. And this is where a lot of conversation around digestion or posture and other benefits of twists can bubble up. Um, and it's really interesting. Both, both ways though, I really, want to, I really want to emphasize, are both valid depending on the intent, depending on the direction, depending on what it is that you're seeking out of doing this twist. Now, if you're interested in more about twisting and how to utilize twisting in your practice, then you're gonna to wanna to look below for the link to my twisting workshop, online workshop that I'm running on February the 11th. So take a peek there and join me for us to dig into more twisting. See you soon.